anything in the past. Far from it. I'm not anti-American. I've never been anti-American. And I think the future will show that uh, my outlook and attitude is in no way directed against the United States. How will you handle, um, or will you handle, China vis-a-vis -vis the United States in, in terms of what kind of economic aid that Pakistan may need? Well, in the first place, I can answer that question in a word, on merit. And uh, our relations with the People's Republic of China and the United States are not incompatible. We can have good relations, cordial relations, relations of confidence with both these great powers. And I don't see why we cannot have good relations also with the Soviet Union. I think it's possible. Because we are not a great power and we don't want to get entangled in great power rivalries. Well, what will the relationship, be, uh, relationship be between West Pakistan and what is now referred to as Bangladesh? Yes, I'm glad you say that because it is really a Bangladesh in the imagination of our enemies and the opponents of Pakistan. East Pakistan is as much a part of the country as is West Pakistan and I will make every effort to keep the country together. India has claimed that it has gone into East Pakistan as a liberator. Well, why doesn't she vacate East Pakistan now if she has, in inverted commas, liberated East Pakistan? So you will see Indian intentions as time passes. But as far as East and West Pakistan are concerned, with Indian vacation, uh, aggression withdrawn, because we cannot really come to a lasting settlement with a foreign country sitting in a part of our country. With Indian aggression withdrawn, I'm quite prepared to, in the name of the people of Pakistan, the interest of our uh, country and the future of our two peoples, that we are prepared to have as loose an arrangement as the leaders of East Pakistan want.